Hey everybody, it's Steven as a key play Fire Chapter 3 and welcome back to Oxen Free. Yep, I'm playing back it once again because it's Wednesday. It's always been Wednesday for it. The last time I did is I was uh, decided to join with take Jonas with me to get to the office to find some sort of a key to get to Maggie Atlas Rizai's house. But the only thing you can find is a strange wall radio, which wave assist lock, which somehow is some sort of a key, is the way how to unlock it using frequency as a key. So this might be very useful how it works for it. So for now, I'm not sure what I did for last time for it, because the last time I did, we went to make it out of this house, and then we're trying to find a way to get out by finding the book keys. But next thing you know, Carissa's been possessed and someone got trapped in us for it and then next thing you know something bad is gonna happen it's like you mess this up and it's gonna be the end of you for it which means we have like a time limit for it we have a time limit for others and me yeah, probably Alex if things getting away for it for it so anyway I'm going to start right now and find a way to leave off exactly what I did last time for it because I'm not sure whether I did leave off for it because it won't let me say the last time I played for it. So, I'll be there just for a minute, guys. So, hang on. Okay, I'm pretty sure this is the part where I just did the last time I have to play it. Is the ghost is somehow apparently it gave us a time limit for it because we don't have much time. You didn't get these right things for it. And they were thinking we had to get back to the cave by tuning in from the source. But the only problem is the cave somehow blocked in. So, they were, we were thinking. What if there's a way to get in another cave for it? Like, an, a different locations for it. There's something in here. Just looks like vacation slides or something. Yeah, I think also you need projectors for it. Alright, there's already something in here. Experiments and findings of experienced phenomena, January 52. Is that number the year? Oh man, if this turns out to be just prehistoric home videos... Yeah. I'm sure God, it's just the first thing. Just give it a second to warm up, will Could you? Could that be Maggie and Anna? Because this it was be. Uh, skip this so one. Okay, we're getting warmer, I think. So, if you look at the like There's uh, some information the for it. The cave is over there. The cave, just like from another angle. Mm -hmm. According to this at least. Oh, but won't it be like locked or something, right? Yeah, how do we get in? It's just like the cave wall, only steel or whatever bomb shelters are made out of. So, we need some place to how to get inside. Right, well, keep going. Oh, what? She knew about these things? Wow, that's crazy. It says yeah. that to fix a temporal tear, that's a mouthful, in the cave, we would need to transpose to the other side and tune into the source within itself. Okay, but we're not doing that, right? Good question. Eh, we have, that's, we have that's to. It's going a little above, above and beyond. Well, I don't know what to tell you, but strap in, boys and girls. Yeah, we have no choice. This is the only way to fix it. It's the only thing that will fix us. I fix it. There's something like tear it apart. Well, something better work. Or we're boned. Or we're boned. Precisely. Oh, guys, stop being all being negative. This is like this looks like the end, but from the from the wrong film thing. Yeah, this is a triangle. Wait, this is something I actually remember from that stupid radio tour thing, cause it like sounded so weird. It's called the call and response system. It unlocks the bomb shelter. This is showing us how to do it. Ah. See, it says when someone sends an emergency signal from the catbird station in the woods, and the receiving station confirms it. It's like a connected response thing. All right, but come on, Nona, do you honestly believe that the old equipment in either building will still work? It's, I don't know, but it's the only thing we have so far. And time's a clicking. Alex and me will head through the woods, do the, um, call part. You and Ren can hang by the door to the bomb shelter and open it when it's ready. Oh yeah. Wait, wait, I am... Um, I'm sorry, I kinda zoned out there for a second. What are we doing? Ren and Nona are team, um, Soaring Eagle, and you and I are awesome squad. <laughs> oh, oh, really? I want that one. And we're splitting up to work on some old fangled machinery to open the bomb shelter, to get into the cave, to yada yada yada, save our lives or whatever. <laughs> okay, I get it. Use the response station to open the bomb shelter. Alright. Let's right. just do this. Break. And if anything goes wrong, please don't tell me. I won't want to know. <laughs> well, I'll be the shit to tell. run over there and specifically tell you at the first drop of bad news. No. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, you are so funny. 
So now our objective is we had to get to the to the road and try and get another call system for it. While Nona and Man is gonna be respond to it, and that way we open up the the bomb shelter for it. We just take up the stairs, so there's a long way to get up here. I wonder what will kind of happen if, if something bad is gonna happen for it. I mean. We still have like time for it, right? We need to get there before anything happens. Like I don't know if the ghosts are trying to mess with us or something, all we we'll get killed for it. I think that's the way for doing it. It's not like we're gonna get killed or something. So, anyway, let's just proceed on and get through the woods before anything bad is gonna happen for it. Oh no! What's happening? Is she lost her mind? Ah! Ran into the under the ocean, and he's drowning. <laughs> Is this a dream? Alex, Alex, okay, are you, are you back to normal? Ah, it's not it, it, it was like a premonition, I think, and, and I know that sounds whatever, but this must be what it's like when people say they do that, because I kind of just saw Ren drowning. Okay, okay, just take it easy for a second. You went all red-eyed, like when we get possessed. I did. I did. You stopped walking and started mumbling, and then your eyes lit up like little road flares. It only lasted like a minute, but we should hurry up and do this before the door on you opens any wider than. What about Ren? The thing with Ren, it was so real. It was like it, I was there with him. Maybe we should go back. But I'm sure he's fine, so let's finish what we started. No, I just ran to get a check on him and see if he's okay. Because I know how to rap really, Ren's gonna click do something stupid. <laughs> No, look, it kind of. Wait, how did they get in here? Hey, guys. Uh, wait. Did I get the plan wrong? Cause if I got it right, I saw, I saw Ren drowning in a. Uh, the only way to describe it is it was like a vision or something. What? Seriously? Alex got maybe like prediction, prediction or something. Yes, it was scary, but it was just a hallucination triggered by ghosts rummaging around through her brain. No big deal. I mean, they're clearly fine. Look, Jonas, it was real. All right. As real as the other loops or any of the other hundred crazy things that have happened tonight. Don't say that. What am I supposed to do with this? It's not like I can really avoid drowning any more than I can normally do on a daily basis. You're on land, Ren. I don't think anything. Well, just be careful. Be careful, all right. I don't know why I saw what I saw, but just keep on your toes, okay? Well, I am now. Yeah. Okay. Well, it's been fun catching up, kids. We'll go do our half of the fix the ghost problem equation now. <sighs> All right. Well, uh, see you after. I just hope so. Don't say that. <laughs> yeah, there's another main one, so I might be useful. I'll try and get to it. I'm not sure the anomalies are gonna be a work for how this thing do. Nah. Uh, there it goes. 202.3. Numb. named after Colonel Caleb Edwards for his glorious and triumphant slaughtering of countless no. families during one of the great ethnic cleansings of the 20th century. The forceful removal of an ignorant people to make space for destined holders is a time honored tradition in our still young country. And you will be a part of that heritage, Alex. Do not resist. It will be over no. soon. Um, what? The island is. That thing! It talking to Alex! What the heck? I don't get it about this anomaly stuff, and exactly, it's still getting weirder and weirder. I don't like this. I mean, this is getting intense, like, I'm not sure about this anomaly thing. Is this some sort of a clue or some mysterious history for it? Which clearly no idea how it was, but I'm not gonna look for some secrets about these uh the letter things I'm really trying to look for, but I don't think for it. But I'll come back to it later if I can play it again, because I heard uh, if you sometimes have to play it again, it it's some sort of like a, a new game plus for it. I mean not much, but I will say it. You know what time it is? 4 a.m. It's what it says. It's four in the morning. Which is usually about the time everyone decides if they're going to bed or ordering another three pizzas. Yeah? What's your vote usually? In, uh... I was at bed. Usually, I'm asleep at a... Why there's a furniture around us? ...in the chip bowl. 
You think this tuning into the tear thing's gonna work? I, really? Yes. Yes. I'm pretty sure. Uh, undoubtedly, without doubt, absolutely, it's gonna work. Well, I'm glad you're confident, because I just have this feeling like these ghosts aren't really concerned. I think that this um, stuff is getting pulled in from, like, their time or something. This is so weird. Why the furniture are everywhere? Uh, yeah, it's not exactly a good omen. I think we're running out of runway here. You mean, like, running out of time or what? I wonder what happened like I jumped there. Holy Jesus, what are you it's doing me. looking across that? There's another, <laughs> there's like another way down here. I've been here before, remember? We used to skip across here as kids, it's fine. Oh my god. You were a bunch of psychos to ever try that, but... And I got achievement for that, exactly, I don't know why. That's really cool. I don't know what it's supposed to do, it's somehow, it's a shortcut. And there's another, there's another normally stuff for it. Let me get down for it. And now I'll turn it here. Oh, I think I found it. Come on, hundred eight point five. No, no, no. Uh, it'll be good having somebody else here to watch after the ground, Bill. I was at Park Warden in Grants Pass, so this will be old hat to me. I can't get to the top tiles for it. William Marshall, a local park ranger working in Edwards Forest, killed himself today after what his wife describes as a years-long battle with depression. His body was found hanging from a tree in the... What? This is a woman, and there's a, some person got killed himself that was next to a tree. Is that the tree that was about this? That he got killed himself? I have no idea. Some strange stuff happened in this island. It's a weird voodoo craziness happening. So ghosts, even especially, we're dealing with radio stuff for it. But I'm not sure why the radio uh, getting any contact with the ghost for it, or some sort of a secret is about the station of how this thing works. Now the station's up at the top of the hill. Yeah. I hope this works. Oh, please, Jonas. Have, have a little faith. I know we can do this. We're just gonna believe in ourselves. It's gonna be up here. I'm sure of it. Ah, there's stupid way to control it. Either it goes up or goes other way. The way had to go up. Now the station's up the oh, top. man, not the I loop thing. Place. God, we're in another loop de loo They always come at the most appropriate times, don't they? <sighs> yeah, they do. Thanks for the update. Can I go back up again? Nope. Well, the station's up at the top of the hill. We're stuck. I hope this works. Yep, I am also... <sighs> hope that. I think I saw someone. Ren! No, no, what? what? What's wrong with Ren? Did Ren get killed? He's... He had an accident. He... He died. I couldn't... How? How? I, I mean... Yeah, we just saw you. How, how did this happen? You were there this whole time, but... He... He drowned. What? He... Took a fall. It's the ghost. The I ghosts are trying to mess with us. He just... He just stopped. It's the ghost. He's trying to mess with us. I mean, does it really like happening right now? Either way, done is done. Thanks, Ren. Whatever you want to call it. I know you're doing it. Just fix it. It's not us doing it, dear. We weren't lying. The time loops, as you've taken to calling them, which we do find so adorable, are of your own making. A bomb? Yeah, sure. Just like you infesting us like lice isn't your fault either. That we have and will own up to. But the other stuff, that we're afraid is on you. Alex, we know you're in charge. Is it, we know is it goes up time to blame on me for no reason? It won't work. It never does. So we have a proposition for you. A proposition. A bargain. Um, a proposition? L like what? It's already over with Clarissa. She's gone. We'll pilot her through the rest of existence and there's nothing you can do to change that. 
But if you agree to let us take her, let her go quietly and without fuss. You won't slaughter the rest of your friends, like young Reginald here. No! We leave the rest of you cattle alone. No, no way! I'm saving everyone! Everyone, everyone is coming home with me. We're all getting out of here. Uh, courage is not always the way, dear. You don't have much time left. Do you know how we know you don't have much time left? Um... Hmm. Well, how do you know exactly? Fine. Shoot. How do you know? We know because we can be Jonas for this long, and his soul is as quiet as an empty church. Just never say we oh, God. provide you all the rules. Okay, Jonas are gone, really. So the girls are trying to make us a deal, either take Carissa, or otherwise it will be messed up and try and ruin it with like Ren. Uh, now we have to deal with this tape player to fix the loop. So now we're in big deep trouble for it. Dealing with Carissa, and now I have to deal with the others. That the ghost are, it's like the ghost knows a plan exactly. Oh, there's Nona. I know he was your best friend, Alex. I I'm sorry. I don't, I don't know what happened. One minute he was there, and then he was just... It's okay, Nona. It's okay, Nona. You, you didn't do anything wrong. I know it's not your fault. Of course it's not your fault. I didn't know him that well, but... I like what I'd gotten to know. I'm sorry. It's... I shouldn't. It's colossally stupid of me to talk about him like that with you here. This is... He was more important. Well, we can still solve it. Come on, we can still crack this. I do not believe. I, I won't. That he's gone forever. I, I just won't. I wish I had your faith in things. It's a tiny thing, but I hope he knew that I liked him. Oh, he knew. And I don't know if he did. He knew, Nana. Don't worry. He knew. Like I said, it's a tiny thing. But thanks, Alex. Yeah. Now let's simply fix the loop, but it's not gonna go and happen for what effective for it. Oh, she'll remember that. The station's up at the top of the. Ugh. God, that was. My mouth feels like I just ate it. They're trying to. They're trying to make a deal for it. They tried to make like a deal with me for Clarissa's life. But I say no. I just say no. Of course, but I don't know. I I just thought you should know. God, that must mean they're getting desperate or something. If they had any, like, power over the situation, they wouldn't try to work out a compromise. But why want that Carissa? Hello? Is there a point for it? Anyone there? What? Are they? Oh, they're, um, they're somehow... I guess they're somehow broadcasting or something from the, uh, station speakers. Yeah. <laughs> Are you guys at the station? They're both alive! Anybody? <gasps> That's all I can. Jonas? God. Jonas? Yeah, no, Jonas, that's a bonus too. Yeah, hopefully. Right in the front. Shut up, Bran. We're all set here for the uh, the thing, the uh, machinery speak and hug or whatever we're doing. Yeah, let's do it. Time's wasted. Bobby Dudler, I don't know who that is. Actually wasted. Like I feel my body wasted away. Oh God. Yeah, that's another the uh, key, keeping stuff. What stuff? The, uh, oh my god, they keep, keep talking. Oh my god, you guys, that no, it was the, it was psychotic to watch. Like almost doesn't quite describe the terror. Okay. Watching her come close. Okay, that's not it. You were perilously close to tumbling into the ocean from like five thousand feet up. It wasn't that oh. high. This is it. Finally! No, it wasn't. Yeah, well. Hello! We're here. We made it. Hello. Oh, hello! This is Edward Island's emergency. How may I help you? If you're being sat on by a very large burglar, just mash the dial with your fist. I have to report the dog, apologize. Oh God, I'd like to report a <laughs> We're just gonna play along with it. Come into my house. They've shaved all my cats. They look better in my mittens. Oh, I just need any and all advice you can give me. Well, first. Everyone just shut up. You can play dress up phone time when you get home. Okay. Yeah, I guess he's right, actually. 
Okay, all right, fine. Send the call. Signal verified. Shelter TF1 open. Nice. I guess it worked. Great. Okay, we'll meet you there. Right. See you at the shelter. Yep. Over and now. Okay, close the time hole and save the day. We're nearly almost finished in the end, guys. We're almost there. Now we have to do is head back to the shelter, which is the at the Epiphany Field. Which no more craziness around here. Wait, how many anomalies I picked up exactly? Nine out of twelve. Okay. I just want to know. I mean, I can't. I don't want them to find secrets for it. But all we need to care about is saving the world. Maybe. I mean, with all these teenagers, how how exactly could they do to saving the world? Oh, geez, that took forever to trying to get walked back for it. But now we're gonna to get the long, well, the easiest way path for it, like by jumping up the cliff. <laughs> Come on, come on, pick up that paste. We gotta deal with the ghost. Well, we have to save Carissa exactly. Because I know for sure the ghosts really want Carissa, but one reason why they want Carissa very much for it, like, it needs some sort of power or her own existence exactly. I have an idea, Mr. Jordan. Ah! Couldn't we have him reborn? Jonas! Okay, 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 I'm... Jesus Christ, I really hate that. But I'm... I think, um... Are you okay now, really? Yeah, I think. It's just, um... Uh, it's scary, Craziness. needless to say, when I, like, drown or whatever in my own body, and it's starting to feel like... Just... Does like, it? How do I say this? Because... It's okay, Jonas. Just say what's on your brain. I just want to say, Yeet. I just, I think it would have been cool us living together for, for whatever senior year. Are you still talk about I'm it? Just glad I met you. That's all. I'm just glad we met. <laughs> I'm glad too. Okay, so there, it's out in the open. We're both glad. Okay, good. So that's it. And now we can go back to the whole escaping and trying to live another day thing. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Let's finish strong now. No half acidness at the end. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're just gonna get this. Hopefully, close the portal, or maybe the time loop thing. Hopefully, for the best. Uh, now we go back into the Epiphany Field. I'm not sure if there's gonna be another more crazy loop thing or time passing thing. Uh, the last time I did, I did have a like just time traveling in the past uh, with Michael. Now it's 5 a.m. What is this, okay, Fnaf? I'm just going to say one thing, and then I promise it'd be the last time I bring it up tonight. But you know you screwed up with Ashley at the concert, right? Who's Ashley? It's not a giant thing. Oh, man, not again. Ash oh. Great, we're back in the past again. My really good friend Amanda, who's moving away forever. That Amanda? Yeah, that Amanda, who stole her mom's car. And I don't care if you didn't know she didn't have permission to take it, because whatever, fine. But you knew you didn't have permission to go to that show. <sighs> Just tell me it's the last time I hear about you stealing a car. However inadvertently, my little heart can't handle it. It'll be my last. It'll be the last time, but maybe not for the reasons you think. I don't really care about the reasons. Just for my own sanity, don't do it anymore. What? Oh, and I wanted to say, um, <laughs> per your advice, I'm gonna... I think I'm gonna really... I just really just like playing along with it. To Clarissa. <laughs> that sounds dumb, like I'm pinning her or something. What does it mean? <gasps> Commit? What the hell does that mean? You're in high school. <laughs> I know, I know. I sound like I'm 40, but I'm just, I don't know. It's going to be, it's not going to be casual anymore. It's going to be a thing, a real thing. That's all. So just get used to her. That's all I'm saying. Come on, let's get to the century before the last boat comes. I got to get the uh, visual aid for the history project. And then I just got to write the stupid essay. What history project? They still make you do, like, work with so little left in the year? Unfortunately. This is, it's just like a town history thing for civics, you know? <coughs> so it's forced me to kind of, I don't know. And I mean, it's funny, I don't know if I even want to be here next year. It's just all so flat. I miss you. Well, if you leave, I'd certainly miss you. Yeah, no, I'd miss you too. It's just that everybody here knows me, you know? 
I know you think I have it on Easy Street, but people looking at you all the time, wanting evidence that it's good, that they lived here, that good things can happen to people that are from here, it can get to be a real drag. Like, how about somebody else be captain of whatever for once? No, great. You were... are great, though. And... and you're gonna be great whatever you do. I'm sure of it. You got spunk, kid. Yeah, well... <laughs> Uh, let's head back before Karen Strands is here. You know, when we saw Uncle Pete last month, I wanted to ask him, because he, he got out moving to New York. And I asked him if it was hard leaving. Know what he said? It was hard? Uh, it was hard? I mean, knowing Uncle Peter, he was probably three sheets to the wind. He said the hardest part was deciding what to take with him and what to leave behind. I thought it was, I don't know, for him, <laughs> kind of almost touching. Interesting. Huh, that's actually... That's not bad. <laughs> I cannot believe I had to pick you up from the police station because of Grand Theft Auto. I mean, that is too funny. <laughs> oh, stop it. Stop it. Okay, there's another craziness in the past with Michael. It's really weird for what's going to happen for it. So, what exactly is going on here? Like, how does it, like, time... Consuming thing to time passing for it. I have no idea. Oh, stop it. Just stop. Ugh. It's 5 30 a.m. Oh, you know, you went bad again. I couldn't get you out of it. We should really I saw Michael again. This done now. I saw. I saw Michael again. I just. I'm sorry. When I'm there, I just get sucked into it like nothing happened. Come on. It's all right. I think I can hear Ren and Nona down there. Okay. It seems we're almost there. And the shutter is open. Just don't say anything to them, okay? This is... It's say anything about what? What are you guys talking about? We're dating. We're dating. Nona and I, we're gonna date. Rin, dude. Uh, what did I just say? What? They asked. Congrats. You asked. Congrats for you, Rin and Nona. The happy couple. Mazel <laughs> Thank you. Oh, I forgot that he kind of Jewish. Stop. It's one date at the Revival Theater. We're just gonna sit quietly in the dark and watch a documentary on Bosnian genocide. Hmm. Who's that? Romantic. Aw, how cute. Riviera is a great movie house. And the ushers can't tell where you're putting your hands if you sit in row G, by the way. Please don't tell him that. <laughs> Anyways, I know it's stupid to be planning or whatever for this, but I don't know. I just felt like he knew I was open to it, so why wait to plan? Whatever. Whatever. Truly the language of love. Oh, well, we got to destroy the you ghost fish. I mean. Okay, well, I'm happy for you, but we still have the little issue of submarine ghosts to, um, exercise. Yeah, that thing. I... I want to get this off my chest. Just... Something happened to us tonight, Alex. Something broke. I don't know if it was the ghost or whatever, but... What? You've been acting like... not you. Ren. No, I just... Well, I I'm... Sorry, I don't... I don't know what else to say, really. I'm sorry. I don't know why I'm even saying this now. This is stupid, but... Can we, like, take a picture? Why? I don't know. We are last. Things go bad and... I mean, this is gonna be our last yeah, chance to see it. On a beach. Kind of. Let's keep a shred of normal here. Alright, let's take it. Alex, get in here. I am! You're not... Well, good to go. Once we're in there, the door won't open again since the system's so convoluted. So, make sure you're ready to finish this before we go inside. I'm pretty sure we're all good to go for it. But now, we have a chance to get inside because there is no turning back for it. But before I do that, let me just uh, have a one last chance for our, our friend here. And we're gonna hug. Oh, I know. Nah, it's a kind of cute to hugging each other. And now, uh, for Nona? Oof. Okay, I... Uh, all right. And... Jonas. I don't know why, but he's still coming. coming with you, you know. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Okay, anyway, let's just do this. And after when I get in here, I'm just gonna stop at this point. And to get some pictures to see the last chance for it. Here it is! It's a shame, of course, I wasn't here for it. It's kind of a nice case picture for it. It seems uh, we got Ren and Nona got couples. You know, 6 a.m. I don't want to say anything to Ren or Nona. 
But anyway guys, I'm going to leave it for now for Oxen Freight. I will say this is going to be a really intense game for it. We're almost nearly to the end of it. Hopefully, if we're able to save Carissa and stop the ghost for good by simply, like, tearing up the, the portal thing by using some radios for it. I think it's not like some sort of way to destroy it because I'm not sure if it's a good thing or it's a bad thing for it. But like I said, this game consists about choices. It kind of depends on what choice do you use. Either try to make this a good thing or bad thing for it, but who knows for it. But I'll come back to it later for next week because I'm not sure it will be like at the end of it. But hopefully there's going to be more ins to this too, more secrets I can find for it. So anyway guys, that's pretty much it for Oxygen Free. If you like this video, hit the like button too. Light them up! If you want to see my videos or check out the other videos, you can subscribe. Until then, I'll see you guys next time. Later!